Hey, what's up everybody? It's Daydreams. Welcome back to the channel for another Clash of Kings video. If you are new here, hit that red subscribe button down below. We do daily videos on the channel. Make sure you tell your lines about the channel. You will get better from watching all the guides and gameplay here on this channel. So, guys, I didn't want to close out the night without talking to you because so many of you are very disturbed by the news that um, Clash of Kings said that they are not, um, you know, fully committing to doing uh, the kingdom transfers where you're going to be able to like move kingdoms to whatever kingdom you want and stuff so um now i've gotten a little bit more information on it but a lot of it's a little bit vague and basically they didn't just totally scrap the idea of um people being able to jump kingdoms but they had already had everything like set like the amount of troops you're going to be able to take all this stuff but i think they're just going back to the drawing boards they're they're basically considering two things merging kingdoms in which case if i if they merge kingdoms i don't think they should just merge like two kingdoms together i think they should merge every five to ten kingdoms together just make it really a very populated kingdom to where there's you know a lot of people in it because um you know even two kingdoms now are like you know very on two kingdoms together would still be unpopulated at least put three to five i think would be probably the perfect magic number that you're going to be able to do so don't be um disheartened yet guys we will we will figure we'll figure out what they're going to do i still think that kingdom jumping is probably their best option and what a lot of people want but there's a lot of people including some of you in the comments that do not want kingdom jumping you would rather have server merges so um as soon as i know like definitive information i will definitely let you guys know but some good news did come out of the gaming world today guys i noticed that there's a new game coming out in two days and i'm about to show you the video for it and then we're going to talk about it and i hope and i hope that some of you will play it with me this isn't a sponsor video or anything i did i mailed them i emailed them just a little bit ago and seen if we could uh work together on some uh projects and maybe make it a staple on the channel so let's take a look at it i'm gonna go to my main screen right here this is uh this i record with my air server uh window okay here it is it's a to uh, it's a rome total war uh mobile game it's coming out on november 10th in two days um so let's go ahead and watch the trailer oops i've already watched it like six times let's watch it again sega. it's made by sega and someone else so it's probably high quality here we go there's the marching troops so that's a, the green player there's the red player look at i love the elevation stuff so you can try to put your archers on elevation attack downhill and get attack bonuses look at this it's beautiful there's like your kingdom look at that attacking uphill oh yeah i'm gonna go for that high ground you know i'm going for that high ground look at that you can flank your troops it's beautiful look at the war elephants are those persian war elephants those are the strongest of the war elephants oh i'm hyped guys look there's purple against green i'm hoping they have like multiplayer teams like where you could play like you know 3v3 4v4 that's what made age of empires so great so i don't know if this game's like um clash of kings where you're gonna build like your castle and your empire and then battle that'd be the best if they make it like an mmo rts game or if it's just gonna be like an rts where you log in and then you decide to fight someone it, all i know it's it has potential to be let's go and watch it again has potential to be a great game it's they're launching it on ipad first so it's going to be just out on ipad so if you got an ipad you can play with me um i'll definitely be 100 doing videos on it even if it's you know i'll at least do one video if it's, look at that that's called the phalanx i love i love old time war it's getting me hyped man i'm thinking my age of empires day is smashing mountain dew and playing age of empires for 12 hours a day look at that beautiful it looks looks good I'm telling you that much right now. It looks like a uh, it looks like a high quality game. It's coming out to iPad. I'll try to find out, um, or if any of you can find out, let me know in the comment section. Is it going to be coming out on any other um, you know devices anytime soon? So, yeah, guys, I'm I'm really hyped for this game. I think it'll be a good you know third game for the channel because right now I've just been doing daily Clash of Kings, Clash Royale. If I I would love a good third game like this to put on the channel and. Um, since it's such a high quality game i'm sure it's going to have a pretty decent audience and maybe we could get some new supporters of the channel so thank you guys so much for watching if you want to watch a cool clash of kings video i uploaded um rick's ancient battlefield video you can click on it right there at the bottom right um and if you want to subscribe hit that logo that's popping up on the top left or if you want to subscribe to rick hit the one that is on the bottom left uh he started a channel as well 
And yeah, we'll do some collabs and stuff together. Rick's a really good guy, and you guys will love his content. So teamwork makes his dream work. Help Rick out, help me out, subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next video. Pa -pa -pa. Peace.